weather and climate. Weather The weather is the condition of the atmosphere at a particular place over a short period of time. The weather changes from day to day or even from hour to hour. It can be sunny in the morning and rainy in the evening. Climate The climate of a place is the average weather conditions over a long period of time. Different parts of the world have different types of climate. The climate of a place affects the plants, animals as well as the people. Different places in the world have different types of climate. The factors that determine the climate of a place are Latitude Altitude Distance from the sea Winds Humidity Ocean currents Latitude or distance from the equator The earth gets heated by the sun. The sun's rays fall directly or vertically near the equator. As we move away from the equator, the sun's rays fall in a slanting way. Different parts of the earth receive different amount of heat. Depending on the amount of heat received from the sun, there are three heat zones on the earth. The torrid zone, the temperate zone, the frigid zone. Torrid zones The areas on the both sides of the equator between the Tropic of Cancer and the Tropic of Capricorn are called Torrid Zones or Hot Zones. These areas experience a tropical climate. India also has a tropical climate as it lies in the Torrid Zones. Torrid Zones remain hot throughout the year. Temperate zones. The areas that lie between the Tropic of Cancer and the Arctic Circle in the Northern Hemisphere and between the Tropic of Capricorn and Antarctic Circle in the Southern Hemisphere are called temperate zones. There are two temperate zones, North Temperate Zone and South Temperate Zone. These zones have mild or moderate climate, neither very hot nor very cold. Frigid Zones The areas between the Arctic Circle and the North Pole in the Northern Hemisphere and between the Antarctic Circle and the South Pole in the Southern Hemisphere are called frigid zones or cold zones. There are two frigid zones, north frigid zone and south frigid zone. These zones receive 
very little heat and are very cold. Remaining factors will be discussed in part 2. Thank you for watching.